please go on and one for Lucy Poo. Hi. <laughs> My name's Lucy, yeah. I swam a 10K last week. <laughs> Thank you. It's not a joke, I just don't think I've told enough people. <laughs> It's around about the seven or eight K mark that I realised that finishing this swim wasn't going to fill the gaping void inside me <laughs> any more than the last one did. <laughs> because, Brian, if we both know, you can't run away from yourself. <laughs> you sure as hell can't swim. <laughs> You'd never be able to swim fast enough, would you? No. Even Michael Phelps is going to have to face his demons one day. <laughs> I'm a teacher. Although I don't identify as being a teacher comedian. George Bernard Shaw famously said that those that can do and those that can't teach. <laughs> I wonder what he had to say about those that can't do or teach. <laughs> Stand-up comedy, maybe. <laughs> Whilst I don't identify as being a teacher, if you ask me whether you can go to the toilet, I'll always say, I don't know, can you? <laughs> and if you don't get that, you might want to revisit your grasp of English grammar. <laughs> Look forward to a plethora of grammar pedant heckles now. <laughs> but as a disclaimer, I'm an art teacher. <laughs> so it doesn't count. <laughs> People often ask me what teaching's like, and I always say, it's shit. <laughs> Occasional moments of humour. Uh, biggest overshare anyone ever said was a year 13 student told me that she was being cock blocked by COVID. <laughs> most honest response to my questioning in the duty-free of a ferry bound for the Somme as to whether or not she had a signature scent. Yeah, I do. B.O. <laughs> <laughs> most postmodern pedagogical fail was when uh, covering a music lesson, asked to do some research on jazz and blues music, one student made a PowerPoint about jazz and the boy band Blue. <laughs> <laughs> worst thing any student's ever said to me, actually it might be the worst thing anyone's ever said to me, was that I had 90s eyebrows. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, she wasn't wrong, but it's not my fault. I blame Gwen Stefani. <laughs> Currently working in an all-girls school. There are literally tampons everywhere. <laughs> so probably best avoided if you've got a phobia of string. <laughs> Looking at you. <laughs> decided to start being a, well, I decided to be a teacher because I couldn't think what else to do with a fine art degree. Decided to start doing stand-up, the same reason that most people start doing stand-up. Because my dad didn't love me. <laughs> <laughs> well, I sure showed him. <laughs> Gonna leave you with the following to ponder on. If you answer a question right on University Challenge, but there's nobody there to hear you. <laughs> Are you still clever? <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs>